Dear viewers, greetings. In this video, we are going to see the history of chromatography. The history of chromatography was started in 1885. A German chemist, Friedleib Ferdinand Rohn, used unglassed paper and pieces of cloths for spot testing, dye mixes, and plant extracts. In 1860, Christian Friedrich Schoenbein and his student Friedrich Goplester introduced the paper strip analysis of dyes, milk, beer, colloids, plant pigments, and animal pigments. In 1903, a Russian botanist Mikhail Zweig first used the chromatographic technique to separate the plant pigments, chlorophylls, and xanthophylls by passing this pigment through glass column packed with finely divided calcium carbonate. The scientist Michael Schwedt was the first person who introduced the term chromatography to this world, uh, so he is called as father of chromatography. Uh, this is the Schwedt apparatus, uh, which was devised by the Russian botanist Michael Schwedt uh, who first invented the chromatography technique to separate the plant pigments, chlorophylls and xanthophylls. In 1941, Archer John Porter Martin and Richard Lawrence Millington Singe invented the partition chromatography. In 1941, Gerhard Hesse used gas absorption chromatography to separate smaller molecules which are below 200 Daltons. In 1943, the first gas chromatograph was built by physical chemist Erika Kremer based on silica filled collar. In 1947, J.G. Kirchner and his colleagues at the U.S. Department of Agriculture were working to determine the chemistry of orange and grapefruit flavors using Thin layer chromatography or TLC. In 1952, Archer John Porter Martin and Richard Lawrence Millington Singe were awarded the Nobel Prize in Chemistry for their invention of partition chromatography. In 1952, the first gas chromatography was invented by Archer John Porter Martin and A.T. James. In 1954, Griffin and George from London, UK, probably manufactured the first commercial gas chromatography system. In 1954, Rudolf E. Kaiser improved the thin layer chromatography and named the technique as High Performance Thin Layer Chromatography or HPTLC. In 1958, Marcel J. E. Gole demonstrated the operation of the capillary column in capillary column chromatography. In 1960, Dennis Henry Destry boosted the era of glass capillaries. In 1967, the first commercial HPLC machine was developed by Waters Association or Waters Associates, now it is called as uh, Waters Corporation, a company which offering analytical tools and systems to scientists. In 1968, Pedro Hutrakigas and Mayor Wilczek introduced the term affinity chromatography. In 1975, ion chromatography was introduced by two English researchers, agricultural scientist Sir Thompson and chemist J.T. Way. In 1975, R. Dandinio and E. Zerner invented the fused silica column, eliminating the problems which are present in the gas column. In 1980, Kurt Grove established the fundamental knowledge about the injection process in the column. In 1987, Pedro Q. Trakizas and Mayor Wilczek were awarded the Wolf Prize in Medicine for
for the invention and development of affinity chromatography and its applications to biological sciences. In 1991, J. Phillips developed the two dimension gas chromatography. In 1996, Nobuo Tanaka at the Kyoto Institute of Technology prepared silica monoliths using a colloidal suspension synthesis. In 2004, higher pressure instruments to support ultra HPLC or ultra high performance liquid chromatography was introduced. And you viewers, that's all about the history of chromatography. Thank you for the support. Thank you.